hello everyone welcome to spiritual butterfly today i will be doing a video for pisces singles these messages will not resonate with everyone as they are general take what does apply it leave the rest also remember to like the video subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell in order to receive notifications when i post so i'm going to jump right into this reading and we're going to see what messages spirit has for you we are going to be taking a look at what is coming in when it comes to love so spirit what messages do you have for pisces Messages for Pisces. Okay. I have the Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. And I have the Lovers in the reverse. So let's get some more messages. I have the Nine of Cups. Let's get one more message. And I have the Sun in the reverse. Okay. Some of you recently gotten out of a relationship. You got out of a connection I feel like you were tired of giving to this person I heard one-sided so you were the one doing all of the work you were the one compromising making all of the sacrifices in this connection I heard like fair share so yes this person never wanted to equally invest right now I see some of you just enjoying life Enjoying being single, enjoying being free, filling your own cups, doing what makes you happy. With the sun in the reverse, you do long for a relationship. You do long for love, for a connection. I heard marriage. So for some of you, you long to be married. You long to have children. But it's just about waiting on the right person. Let's clarify the seven of pentacles in the reverse. I have movement in the reverse. Yes, this relationship was not going anywhere. Yes, a stalemate. You stop fighting for this relationship. You stop giving to this connection. Let's get a message for the lovers in the reverse. I have forgiveness in the reverse. Um, for some of you, I feel that this person had nothing to offer you or did not want to offer you anything stable, anything solid. Um, with this forgiveness in the reverse, there is no coming back. You're not reconciling with this person. You are moving on or you have already moved on. So let's get a message for the Nine of Cups. I have promise in the reverse. Yeah, I feel like you're just focusing on yourself. You're deciding not to invest into a relationship. You're using this time to heal. You're using this time just to do what brings you fulfillment. I feel like you're tired of the games. You're tired of people lying to you. You're tired of being in relationships that do not work out being in connections that do not give you what you want being betrayed it's like you're just tired of it and you're in this space where you just don't have time to deal with anyone or you don't want to deal with anyone you just want to be to yourself you just want to remain single let's get a message for the sun in the reverse
okay. I have family in the reverse, yes. Spirit confirmed it. You long for family. You long to be in a relationship. For some of you, this was a divorce. This was you um, disconnecting from someone that you were married to or someone that you had children with. But I see you longing, longing for a family, but feeling like you're never going to get it. So let's clarify further. further. Spirit, give me a message for movement. Okay. I have the Queen of Swords. I have the Nine of Pentacles. I have the King of Wands. And I have Death in Rebirth. Pisces, this happened for your good. This happened so that you can finally start focusing on yourself. For some of you, you may overgive. When it comes to relationships quite often, you may put yourself last and put other people's needs before your own. Um, this is about you knowing your worth. Like you had to go through this disappointment in, uh, in order to get you to this period of change. Yes, Pisces, some of you are going through a transformative period, a period of change, a period of changing your mindset, a period of changing the way that you do things. Recognizing your worth, standing your ground, setting boundaries. Because it's like, as long as you let people walk over you, as long as you allowed other people's needs to come before your own, you were never going to have a fulfilling connection. This is about you first learning how to fulfill yourself. You learning your worth. You not accepting anything. And then you will be able to call in what you truly deserve. But it starts with you, Pisces. And so Spirit is saying a season of change, a period of change that is going to bring you so many wonderful things, so many new opportunities, so much growth. So yes, this relationship now working out was actually a blessing in disguise. It's helping you to become a better person. It's helping you to really learn how to love yourself. Let's get a message for forgiveness in the reverse. I have the star in the reverse. I have the six of pentacles in the reverse. And I have the five of pentacles. Yes, Pisces, you're done with this relationship. You are not getting what you wanted out of this connection. This person made you feel like you were alone. Like you were the only one in this relationship. They did not give to this situation. With the star in the reverse, Spirit says like you don't see them the same. Like you don't feel the same way that you once did about this person. Like your feelings have faded. For some of you, I heard cycle. This was a continuous cycle with this individual. I also heard back and forth. It was a lot of back and forth. But it's like you finally got tired of it. You got tired of feeling alone. You got tired of being mistreated. And you decided to do something about it. Let's get a message for promise. I have the world, I have the three of cups, I have the three of wands in the reverse, and I have the page of wands. This is you doing something new. For some of you, you have a difficult time being single, being by yourself. So this is you trying singlehood out without talking to anyone. Day without dating. This is just you being by yourself. This is you trying something new. I heard completion. Yes. 
completing a cycle going back to death and rebirth pisces this is about your spiritual growth in order for you to call in love, you first have to evolve. You have to change. You have to close out cycles. And I see you doing that. It's like the ending of this cycle finally with the Three of Cups gives you the support that you need. And Spirit says the support that you need, the support that you was waiting on, it was already within you. You learning how to support yourself. You learning how to love on yourself. You learning how to give to yourself without anyone else, without expectations from anyone else. You realizing that you don't need anyone to be happy. You don't need anyone to be fulfilled. That comes from within. Three of wands in the reverse. Like you were waiting on something that was never going to come. Because it was in you to give it to yourself. You had to give to yourself and not rely on anyone else to give you the love that you deserved. And not rely on anyone else for your peace, for your joy. Yeah. Waiting on something that was never going to come because you already possessed it, Pisces. Page of Swords, I'm doing something new. You're doing something new. So let's get a message for family in the reverse. I have the fool in the reverse. Some of you may feel like you're never going to meet the right person. Or you feel like you always end up with the short end of the stick. Never happy, never fulfilled. The ball always drops. And it's like you may be fearful. You may be holding yourself back from being in a relationship because of your past experiences. Let's get another message. Eight of Pentacles in the reverse. Not willing to do the work. For some of you, you're not willing to do the work. Or this person wasn't willing to do the work. But for those of you who are not willing to do the work when it comes to a relationship, this isn't about doing the work when you're connected to someone when you're married because you want family you do desire this even though you may act like you don't sometimes but you do desire this but it's about doing the work going back to death and rebirth Scorpio energy you have to do the work on yourself That's what spirit is saying, Pisces. You have family in the reverse. You have the sun in the reverse. Eight of pentacles. The fool in the reverse. It's in the reverse because first, you have to work on you. Before you can call in what you want, you have to do the work. In your own life. Within you. And that's what spirit is saying. Be willing to do the work. Nurture the relationship with yourself first. So let's pull some final messages. I have the Hierophant in the reverse. I have the Queen of Wands. And I have the Two of Swords.
Stop settling. Stop settling. Stop settling for relationships that you know are not for your highest good. Stop trying to force relationships to work out when they're meant to fall apart. Those relationships that didn't work out, those relationships that fell apart, Pisces, they didn't work out for a reason. They didn't work out because something better was meant to happen in your life. You were meant to receive something better. So it's like stop forcing situations that are not meant to be. And know that you deserve better. Learn your worth. Learn your value. Know that you are meant to be happy. Know that you are meant to have every good thing that life has to offer you. But you have to know that, Pisces. You can't expect for anyone else to know that. People are going to treat you the way that you allow them to. So once you start treating yourself good, then you will... Learn how to expect good from others. So I hope that these messages resonate. Remember to stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Everyone, stay blessed.